to me getting rid of the police. Like, the police will still be there. Defunding the police simply means that <clears throat> you're going to um, put more money into social programs. For instance, I don't remember where this was, but a police officer shot a... Um, Autistic black man. He wasn't doing nothing. You know, that. and when I say things like systematic racism, I'm talking about stuff like that, you know. Um, hello. Um, I'm talking about, you know, these narratives that have been put out ever since, you know, the ending of slavery about how, you know, black people are just threatening because they're so big and they huge and, you know, a lot of uh, non-black people, especially non-ADOS folk, because you can, uh, at least by 50% of the time, tell an American black person from a black person of a different um, ethnicity. So, but they push these narratives that black people are big and scary and I think a lot of people that are not black have internalized that thing and even some black people have internalized that thing and um it's just gotten out of hand when this officer shot this autistic man he didn't do anything he just sat there he asked him he said why did you shoot me and the officer said I don't know you know things like that should not happen and see when you defund the police and you put uh that money into other agencies it's not just the police officers going back out there by themselves ideally and theoretically speaking you know can never say how people are going to implement a certain thing but if someone calls the police because they have a loved one who has and this has happened several times 